Hi, this is Beth Forrester with Photoduds, and I'm here today to show you our product called Boca Overlays. So I decided that I wanted to add some interesting lighting to some of my images, so I decided to create these overlays to do that effect for me real easily. So I've got a couple files here, and we're going to open up a couple of uh, images that I've photographed and show you how we can take these overlays really quickly and change the image. So here you can see I've opened up the Duds Boca Texture um, 03 and an image that I shot. And what I'm going to do simply is drag this Boca layer on top of the image, move it around to where I want it to be. And then I'm going to go into the um, mode, and I'm going to change the mode of the uh, Boca file to screen. Now as you can see really quickly I've already uh, changed the file. Now you can, these are pretty large so you can resize them, move them around uh, to get the effect that you you want on your image. So really quickly you can see just by doing that really quick I've changed the whole look of the image, the feel of the image and created something more interesting. Now let's say you don't, you kind of in the center here you can see that it's a little it's lightened up the image a little bit you can actually go on top of this overlay and sometimes what I might do is uh, do a pretty nice feather here and just darken that area just to have a little less of that um, you know impact right on the face so you can see it actually sort of fades out um, that's just up to you so you can see this is again screen mode this is what normal mode would look like and you can see now where I've actually darkened that center portion of it from what it originally was and then go back to screen mode and you can see the effect so let's open a couple of different ones I just want to show you this uh, with a couple of different files so here I have a lighter image of a blue a girl shot in front of a blue flowered background and I'm going to open this uh, Boca Texture number two. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and rotate the image um, counterclockwise here so I can make a vertical like my image. Just drag it, drop it onto the image and again going into screen mode. Now I'm just going to move it around to see you know where I may or may not like it. Now in, the, in this case again you can see some of its darkening her face a little more than maybe I might like or care to have. Uh, you can see right there um, right across like her lips and area like that it's really lightened a lot. So again what I might just do here is go on in and, and make make a lasso kind of around the area that I feel like it's you know maybe lightened the image just a bit too much. Um, do a nice feather. Feather is going to depend on the file size of your original image so that's just to your taste and preference. So you can see here I'm, I'm minimalizing the impact of that lightning just by going in and, and darkening that layer in that one particular area. So you can see here how I can just change this image and the overall look of it really quick uh, with the blending mode. So let's do one more. Um, I, I kind of occasionally like to take an outdoor image and sort of make it look like a wash. So we have one of these uh, bokeh um, textures that's a little more going to give it sort of a washed effect. Again, I'm going to go in here. I'm going to rotate the, the texture. So I I'm actually going to flip it. And again, bring, just bring it on here to the file. This is quite large in comparison to this file. This file is a, a file that I cropped down quite a bit. You see, I'm just taking this Boca file down. They they start out really large. We want to make sure that you can use them on, you know, big prints and so forth. So again, I'm just going to change this into screen mode. You can see I've just got like a little sun-kissed wash there. Um, with this file. Again, if I wanted to go in and minimalize that impact on her face, uh, maybe I want to flip it again. Um, let's flip it so it looks like it's from coming from the sun on the left side of the image. I could just flip the um, the texture there and you can see we can give it just like a sun-kissed look. And thanks for watching and that's the Duds Boca Texture.